I really hope I don't regret this. Okay, y'all have a great time. I'm not actually sure I want to do this. The longest continuous footpath in Texas clocks in at 96.6 miles. You would go back, oh! I decided to through hike it with my five kids. Are you done? Backpacking isn't unfamiliar to my older boys, and I've had one previous experience. But a through hike another animal. The Lone Star Hiking Trail crosses the Sam Houston National Forest. But before we even got to the forest, we had a ton of preparing to do. We planned to stash food and water along the way, so there was all that to get ready. There was old gear to pull out and evaluate, there was new gear to add, and then there was practicing carrying our loaded packs around the lake behind my dad's house. Okay, finally, there comes Shy. Shy is coming. Okay, once more the bathroom and civilization, and now we have to go. With all that preparation, I thought I would feel so ready, but I just couldn't get rid of the feeling that I have no idea what I'm doing. Broke camp. The night was not too eventful, other than Ozzy got a burn because we built a fire. And nobody slept super great. Oh, Tess, did you sleep good last night? Tess, did you sleep good last night? You broke down camp. All in all, I think it's taken. Ozzy, what time is it? Oh my gosh. And an hour and 41 minutes. This is way too long. Soldier Oh, Tess, is that delicious? Tess is gonna go for a little swim. But I don't think I can let Nava lead again because she worked us way too hard. She made us walk two and a half miles in 59 minutes. Although I was the first one to actually uh, get Ozzy was the first one to tag, yeah, but man, Nava pushed and pushed and pushed us. Nice job, Nava. Okay, Shai. Ready? His backpack and Nava's. Thanks, Shai. By the time we got to our campsite at day two, we were already a day ahead of schedule. We all had a moment at camp that night. Everyone was crying, including me. It just felt like we were so tired and proud that we'd come 20 miles, but overwhelmed at how much more there was to go. Feelings will pass, I said. Feelings will pass. Let's wake up and go again tomorrow. Thirty-four, and it is Ozzy. What time? Four thirteen. Okay. We had extra push today, but we had a medic with us in case anything went wrong. So we're safe. At the end of day three, we were another day ahead of schedule. Okay, I think we've got this thing. The biggest challenge to this through hike was actually boredom. <laughs> okay, try again one more time. Go, go, go. It was just a long, long walk in the woods that started first thing in the morning and didn't end until Three. evening. <laughs> we learned how to count in German. I taught them a song in Swahili. We played think of an animal A to Z, think of a national park A to Z, think of a food A to Z. During the road section on day four, we came across a little free library. Are you done? 
The kids grabbed a couple books and we read in the tent that night by flashlight and it was the best. Okay, 7.30. Do you know what is special about this mile? Half halfway. We are Wait, halfway. I'm not halfway yet. Halfway, come on, cross the marker. Halfway. halfway. Our Shabbat rest day was never more eagerly anticipated and honestly was very sad to see it end. It's Saturday night and I'm so scared because I know we have a river crossing tomorrow and it's going to be in the middle of a really long day, near the end of a really long day. <sighs> so relieved. Nava, aren't you relieved that we don't have to walk as many miles today? Oh, because one section was going to be burned. Okay, that means that this river crossing does not have to happen at the end of the day. We can get it over with at the beginning of the day. Oh my goodness, such a relief. Another hiker. Reports that we read about this river crossing was that just a week before we arrived, it was impassable. It was absolutely the greatest feeling of relief to be able to cross it, only getting wet like up to our calves. Six miles left to go. I will be limping to the end. I will be limping. Sunny will be limping. Raya says he will be dancing. I'm gonna be reading. <laughs> Rafi will be reading. Oh, oh hi, Jess. She'll be eating. She'll be so sad to. To have this over. She, she has lived her best life on the trail.
So we're through hikers now. And you know what that means? Good gravy. We need to shower. <laughs>